Hi everyone, I'm Master Shawinton again. Happy to see you. And right now we are on the second episode for this 12 zodiac sign forecast, the 100% English version. All right. And previously I posted a one that is for the first four zodiac sign. And now in this second episode, I'm going to share for the, the other four zodiac signs for you. So the first one to share right now is those born in the year of the goat. And goat, we all know that last year, because the year of the ox, it was actually a clash of the yearly star. And that's why we say that, you no, know, for those born in the year of the goat was uh, having a lot of challenges, unstability, but definitely a lot of learning. And definitely this is what we want to, uh, what we call evolve from the previous year. And with all the precious experience accumulated and the uh, good this year, you are able to overcome obstacles easily by having overseas luck change. And luck change is the one that I always have a question asked by clients. You know, I want to uh, turn my luck around and how can I do it? And this way is a simple way that everyone can do it. Okay, I will share over right now. For overseas luck change, uh, what you can do, literally you can go to another place or preferably another country. But I know right now because of the COVID-19 travel restriction, traveling might not be as easy as it used to be. You can actually uh, maybe go to another like a, a staycation, okay? What you can do is you can wear a set of clothing that you do not want to have it anymore. And you reach a destination, you can discard them away. And this will actually meant that you are discarding the negativity, throwing away all the things that you do not want and uh, just put the past behind you. All right. And next, when you are coming back home, you can actually wear a set of the clothing back, which is new and your lucky color for the year. So what is your lucky color? I'm going to share with you later over here as well. And for those who are not born in the year of the goats, you can always follow this and using the lucky color that I've shared during the forecast for your own zodiac sign. And the less positive star for you, it is uh, for to be more mindful about is to be more conservative in terms of your financial commitment. All right, do not always uh, be too optimistic that uh, say yes without considering all the different scenarios, do your due diligence first. And the lucky color to you is red. Yes, so this year use more red as well as the overseas stock change. I mentioned earlier, come back and wear something that's red or top or bottom, that'd be good enough. Doesn't mean the whole uh, from top to toe that you need to be all in red. And this is your report card. Okay, you can uh, definitely go for it this year. You can see the lowest is actually 65% and the highest is up to 78%, especially on the work and school luck. And this is what you are looking for. I'm sure you can achieve much more this year. So congratulations for those born in the year of the goat. And now we have the monkey. Okay, for those born in the year of the monkey, and if you're not sure, uh, if you're born in the year of the monkey, I always check on the left site that on the year that you were born in, you know whether you were born in the year of the monkey. Uh, first thing, you need to be very careful about your diet. You need to have a balanced diet, nutritional, uh, what we call intake. This will help you get the required energy to handle the daily demands well. Because this year will be exciting for you in a way whereby things are changing very fast and you need a lot of mental and physical energy and input to get the best out of it. And next is for you to improve on your positive energy. You can have more outdoor activities. All right, outdoor activities uh, means really out in the nature, in the park, under the sun, that'll be better, okay? Of course, for those who have been regularly working out in the gym, uh, please continue. Doesn't mean you can't do it. It's just that for a higher leverage, for you to improve your life even more, outdoor activities are the best. Always on the move to harness the auspicious energy. 
All right, so you can actually move more and you can get to uh, increase your positive luck in this way. And your lucky color is white. So use more white for you and it will help you feel more balanced and grounded as well. And the report card for those born in the year of the monkey, and this is the four aspects of life uh, for you to be uh, what we call in the know, so you know how to balance them. So you can see even this year, for the uh, those in the born, born in the year of the monkey, this tiger year is what we call a clash for you. But you can see that, hey, you no, know, uh, it's still 60% even for the lowest. So wow, okay, congratulations. So definitely, you can do much more than you expect. And next, we have the superstar for the year, and this is our rooster. All right, and for those born in the year of the roosters, perhaps you want to just put your uh, let us know who you are, and we can acknowledge you in the comment box. Okay, and uh, this year, you know, you can fly even higher than the seven four seven. All right, so how? Wonderful for you, okay? And uh, this is what you can expect. Fame and fortune are the highlights for you. You can actually increase a lot of your recognition. People like you and you can get your rewards in as well. So take massive action, all right? Make every single day count. 365 days is a best new day for you. All right, so do not be always have a self-limiting belief. Something to be more mind, mindful is uh, not to be tempted by greed. All right, greed is something that is easily uh, what we call a uh, cause, the unlucky star to surface. All right, and this year the unlucky star is actually dormant, so you'll not be triggered easily. But if you are tempted by greed and uh, you are doing things with uh, like, less ideal uh, conduct or like uh, taking some shortcuts and that will be detrimental. And your lucky color is yellow, all right? And uh, use more yellow and attract the lucky stars all the way. And this is a report card. Wow, you can see all the very nice numbers, all the eight, 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 you can see there over. Uh, oh, not report card, the health is 78%. As I mentioned, you're busy. A lot of things to do. Health is the one that you need to build up to have a strong foundation. With a strong foundation, definitely can jump and reach the stars. Okay, and now uh, we have those point in the year of the dog. This year, okay, this is the mantra for you. Learn more, earn more, do more, and be more. Okay, why we need to do this? All right, because the lucky stars for the dog needs to be triggered through a learning environment, a learning mode. Okay, of course, you know, the more we learn, the more we earn. And with the more uh, resources we have, we can share more, we can do more for other people, you know, we can be more. And we need to definitely going to create a year of abundance for you if you can follow this mantra. Okay, to be careful about your personal safety. Okay, uh, do not be rash. Think twice before reacting. Okay, you, uh, not to always, uh, like last minute appointment, always think through your route, prepare in advance all the things you need to prepare and get ready. Okay, and this is the way for you to get the best out of the coming year. And your lucky color is orange. Over here is the luck chart for you, all right? You can see it is above average for every single one, ranging from 62 to 65, and all the different areas of life are balanced. So you follow the mantra I shared earlier on, learn more, do more, okay, and be more with other people. And this is what you can definitely be even more because you can see the room for improvement is so much for you. Now we have reached the end for the second episode and that is a Chop Zodiac forecast uh, ranking for those who are actually interested to see how you fare among the rest. And if you are interested to know more about the four pillars of destiny to understand about how your year, month, day and time of 
birth able, able to affect your luck cycle to do a stronger and more accurate forecast instead of just a year you can always drop me a note from uh, my webpage sherbrinton.com you can read up the different services i provide as well or you can reach out to me through social media pages like uh, my facebook or the instagram you can uh, drop me a pm or you can also leave a message in the youtube so i can get back to you so with that have a awesome year ahead. I'm Master Sherwin Teng. I see you soon.